So within Batch, and, and just something that I want to talk about with Batch, I'm not going to go through the whole list of this, these things, right? We're, com of course, compliant with, you know, ISA 88, <laughs> as any Batch system would need to be. Um, but the Batch management system that Aviva has goes beyond the, the, the standard set by ISA 88. So providing more detail and more transactional knowledge beyond that in terms of connections. So as material flows from one entity to the other, defining what connection is facilitating that transfer, um, as well as if I move material, um, right, there's a concept of transfer management, which is extends beyond the traditional uh, phases and um, uh, that are associated with that ISA 88 model. Um, but really the, the main selling point of our batch system is if you are familiar with a batch environment is that you don't need to rewrite the control system layer to be an isa 88 standard right oftentimes if you're in this space right our customers are getting oem uh you know skids off the shelf from a vendor and and those skids weren't built with isa 88 in mind right um and so um, really in conjunction with system platform, system platform can manage that ISA 88 standard. You don't need to spend the, the vast investment to uh, rewrite the control system code in that particular standard. You can you know, use what you've got already there and then just manage the whole batch system within software, which really makes it much easier to manage, um, much easier to implement and really significantly lower the capital investment required to undergo kind of a, a batch implementation. And uh, with that, right, batches, you can, you can integrate that with InTouch, you can integrate that with OMI. Um, so there's really nice ways that I can integrate that. And this is an example of a batch application that's been integrated into our OMI product. Um, and uh, you can see, you know, the sequential function chart. You can see the back ex execution list, um, as well as some operator messages and actions and and some statuses that you can see on the right hand side, just as an overview from a high level standpoint. Um, you know, all these controls are actually .NET controls that we've embedded into um, the actual application. Um, and if you're curious and you want to learn more about this, just you know, uh, reach out to your uh, account manager or to um, us directly, and we're happy to talk about it.